Hey guys, what's up? It's Mia. Welcome back to my channel. I know it looks like it's nighttime right now, but actually we're just in a parking garage. We went to Shenzhen for the day, and while we're in Shenzhen, I'm like, well, why not stop at Taco Bell? I've never gone to Taco Bell in China. I haven't gone to Taco Bell for now like almost two years that we haven't left China, so kind of excited, but it's Taco Bell, which obviously is better when you're drunk uh, so anyway I just wanted to try it to see what Taco Bell is like here in China and I don't know if Chinese people are eating it or if it's gonna be mostly foreigners but also we're just gonna check out the mall so anyway I'm pretty excited and let's go eat <laughs> Grapefruit um, mojito because this Taco Bell serves alcohol. It's not bad actually, it's a little light, but you can actually taste that there is alcohol in it. I think it's very nice and refreshing. Um, I just got the quesadilla, one of my favorites. It's not filled, it's literally filled this much out of this much. So, mmm. It has the same like spicy sauce that they have in the quesadilla, which is my favorite part of the quesadilla actually at Taco Bell is the spicy sauce that they put in the quesadilla, but it's nice and cheesy. I'm just worried about this part of the quesadilla that's completely empty. I've got chips and pico de gallo, not really so. so. Mm -hmm. It's not bad. Pico de Gallo seasoned chips. You could choose. We also got some fries to try. Pretty good. Milk got a meat platter and gave me a nice piece of chicken. Mmm. Mmm. That chicken is really good. Really good. And he got sweet potato fries with his. I'm gonna take one. Sweet potato fries that are also really good. And you got a sauce. Can I try your sauce? Mm. That's the other thing though. They didn't give us any hot sauce. We didn't ask. We don't know if they even have hot sauce like in the States, but. Mm. I'm very happy with my quesadilla, so. No complaints here. I have it. Where's the sriracha? Mm -hmm. Oh, I guess they have some sriracha type yeah. sauce. We can try it with a fry. Okay, yeah, it's almost like almost sriracha mayo y, like creamy sriracha. It's okay. All right. Biggest disappointment is they don't have Taco Bell sauce. I mean, come on. What makes Taco Bell Taco Bell without the taco sauce? You know what I mean? Anyway, I just realized that my quesadilla only came in three pieces, and usually it comes in four. Whatever. I'm still happy with it. And the prices actually were not that bad. I will say that because I think like McDonald's and Burger King, KFC, those types of places in China I find are actually more expensive in my opinion of like, you can't find something for like $1, $2 type thing here. I think. They're quite more expensive, but here, honestly, it wasn't that bad. Yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna keep eating. Yeah. All right. 
right hey now we're back in the car going to another destination but i wanted to give a final thoughts about taco bell here in china i was going to do it at the restaurant but then a bunch of people came and it was a little too loud so anyway final thoughts do i think you need to go out of your way to go to taco bell probably not um there's just some familiar flavors that maybe would remind you of home like for me it was just the quesadilla i just love taco bell quesadillas and used to get them all the time so that was nice i mean their chips and fries like stuff was pretty plain we didn't get any like the cinnamon did they have cinnamon twists or cinnamon something and they had these other like the cream cheese balls but we also didn't try those so out of what we got it wasn't like bad and it wasn't super expensive but like I said, I wouldn't go out of my way. I'm probably not going to be craving it. Honestly, I just went to Taco Bell mostly out of curiosity because I just wanted to see what it was like. I was pretty surprised with the amount of Chinese people there. Some places, you know, if it's a, like a Mexican restaurant, I feel like there's usually more foreigners, but maybe because it's fast food and I don't know. A little different but also we were in Shenzhen where people maybe are more adventurous and open to trying different foods yeah I would say the quesadilla was good the mojito was good the meats were okay I think the chicken was really good on the meat and the sweet potato fries were really good I mean who would think that Taco Bell would have sweet potato fries but I was definitely definitely down for sweet potato fries and alcohol I mean come on every Taco Bell should have alcohol as for disappointments would go I mean obviously we weren't exactly thrilled it's Taco Bell don't expect high quality stuff the meat was okay like I said the chicken was pretty good the beef was pretty like processed meat um, but <laughs> honestly our biggest disappointments were for me there was no Taco Bell sauce I mean come on I need hot sauce I need fire sauce I need something I just like that extra spice. The, the most they gave us was the sriracha mayo whatever, which, like I said, pretty depressing. I need the spicy Taco Bell, you know what I mean? And then they didn't have salt and packets and the meat was a little bland, could use a little salt or something. So honestly, yeah, our biggest disappointments were just the seasonings, I guess, and not having I can't wrap my hand around. I wish I would have looked like <laughs> in every nook and cranny in the restaurant and made sure that I didn't have anything because what's Taco Bell without Taco Bell sauce? What? That's pretty much my opinion on Taco Bell in China. I'm probably not gonna go back. I don't even know if I would even be craving Taco Bell if I was in the States, you know? It's not like you really want to go to Taco Bell, you just end up at Taco Bell late at night. Anyway, so that's gonna be it for this video. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions about living in China or the kinds of foods that they have here, definitely let me know. But thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!